So this is the basic Mega Tracker control box. It's got a waterproof UV rated member membrane keypad on the front. Right now the unit's powered off. I can remove this, unplug ribbon connector. Just head right there for that. We can see the inside here. Now these two RJ45 connectors, standard Cat5 cables, um, are connected to motor driver like this or HB2 motor driver. There's room to mount one here but it's a bit cramped um, so I've got them mounted externally here. This little step down power supply is taking the 24 volt DC that the motors are getting and stepping it down to 9 volts to power the mega controller which has an Arduino 256 motherboard and this is the mega tracker shield if you will. So if I remove the LCD we've got full access to the input output headers along the side so this can be used for uh, light sensors or wind sensors um, monitoring temperature voltage other things like that. In the center we have space for an XB like this which provide remote uh, serial monitoring uh, capability. So right now I've got a USB cable connected here which allows the same thing from my laptop. So that's the basic control box. I just put the uh, plug that back in. Tighten the screws down and we're ready to go.